Hello internet and welcome back to the Rodiverse. Aaron here with some more Pokemon Azure Horizons. So, actually, the guy who was trying to break those rock smash rocks back in the Morphic Tunnel, he actually finished breaking them when we went back after getting to Quinn. So it was a much, much easier time of retracing our steps because it was just like, like you just turn left and then up and then whoop, you're out of Morphic Tunnel easy peasy so also he also gave us rock smash tm for rock smash and i think that's pretty good for the game right now so i'm gonna actually teach that to machi to give you the fourth move and uh i think we are gonna be taking on some grass types so i'm gonna lead off with precious but um also i um i trained machi to level 12 I was thinking of getting her to about level 13, but then I figured, what's the point? I don't think I'm even going to use her, so it should be fine. Let's actually see if we have any berries. Nope, just a raspberry that we found somewhere, so nothing we can really give to our Pokemon, which is sad. We have berry juices though, right? So the cool thing about berry juices is that they can actually, the Poke Pokemon can actually use them like berries so we're gonna give these to you guys real quick it's a really good thing that i bought plenty of these i should really buy more i should have bought more actually okay anywho all right the gym's ready let's just go yep grass gym fellow newbie trainer hello do you aspire one day to become a top trainer then hear me out for some useful information I would be stoked if this guy gives us um, fresh waters. All right, let's get happening. Quinn trains bug types. Okay, okay. Fire or rock attacks can easily take down your opponents. I'd also suggest bringing some status healing items as well. They'll help you greatly in battles. Oh no, damn. Okay, so um, so we should have actually trained Giola. We really should have trained Giola. That's fine, I'm sure we can uh, get through this with Precious, right? Hoping we don't have to use many strategies. This is an old hack after all. I don't know. But we can actually use Marshall, right? Because um, her water gun won't be not very effective to bug types. So let's give her berry juice. And let's just go through with this. You're challenging this gym. You'll have to get through me first. Let's see what you got. Picnicker Devin, okay. Lediba. Meet my gust. That's a one shot and a surskit. Yo. Oh no. Not a one shot. And you had water pulse at level 10? Hello. What the hell is that? Alright, two trainers. Let me battle you with the skills that Quinn has taught me. What skills? Bug catcher Rodney. Caterpie. I think the skill you should learn is evolution, because we're going to kill that thing all right quick. Level 14 now for Precious. And the Metapod. Oh, this is going to get me to level 15 really easy. Hell yeah. Not really. I'm kidding. Are we going to evolve? No. We evolved level 16, I feel. That would be amazing, though. If we evolved. I, I probably should have trained um, Pidgey to evolve uh, off screen. But you know what? That might mean... That might have meant that we had a very easy time with this gym, so let's get maybe a little bit of a challenge. So this is... I already forgot your name. I will save state anyway. And then uh, wait a little bit for the thumbnail, and let's talk to you. Hey trainer, welcome to Gordian Town's gym. I'm Quinn, right, Quinn. Let's remember that name, let's stop having short-term memory. And I train bug types. I haven't been a gym leader for long, but I know that I need to test your potential as a trainer. My bugs will be the ones who'll squash you flat. let us go! Seriously, by the way, that was a redesign you were going for your gym? Just trees? Alright, you have three Pokemon though. Shoot. You have a nice sprite. Spinarak. That's a bug something, right? Or is it just bug? No, I think it's bug poison. Shoot. Yeah, let's gust. Level 12, too. Goodness. Toxic! 
Are you kidding me? We have antidotes at least. What on earth? Let's finish you off. No! Potion! Ah, I should have antidoted. It's fine. This is not good whatsoever. Um, well, I'll, I'll lose a little bit more HP, but I should take out the spinner rack. All right, I'll do that first. And I think the way Gen 3 works is they'll first have to switch out their Pokemon before I get any more damage, right? Yeah, 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 that's true. So Pineco, we need to switch out for you. I'll put maybe Geola as a death fodder and we're going to heal precious of the poisoning because that toxic is ridiculous okay rule of thumb have at least one death fodder pokemon with you all right antidotes have three thankfully dig yo what the hell oh that's perfect what's well, perfect actually i can go to precious now and dig won't do anything why do you have really good moves? Yeah, it doesn't affect precious, good strats. So you're just a bug type, right? You don't gain that steel typing until you turn into a fortress. And we outspeed, so hopefully this gust does a lot. Nothing. And you have a rock tomb. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Let's risk it. Shoot. Revenge? Oh, thank goodness. Does it kill me? Alright. It's gonna be one of those hacks again. I mean, the Pokemon themselves aren't too scary looking, but the moves they possess, so much better than ours. Artificial difficulty once again. All right. Looks like we'll never find a ROM hack that has a perfect difficulty. Just give us, gives the, gives a spinner rack a toxic, gives Pineco dig rock tomb, fucking revenge. Level 4 for Geola though, that's pretty cool. Yanma! Oh god. We'll stay in because, yeah, Precious is our best bet. You will outspeed us, I feel, because Yanmas have speed boost. And no more berry juice for us either. This is a bug flying, right? Oof. Geola would have been great here, that's fine. Hypnosis? Please miss, thank you. Thank you for the miss. I don't have anything to heal hypnosis. <gasps> and you have speed boost. Gosh darn it. Can a quick attack kill you here? I want to deal as much damage as possible before you put us to sleep. Yep. Aerial Ace. Holy crud. Quinn, do you have one more potion? You don't. Oh, thankfully. You don't. That was great. Quick attack. Saved our butts. And we beat gym leader Quinn. M my bug Pokemon. They were the ones who were squashed instead. And give us 14 hundies. That's perfect. Whoa, you really were as tough as you looked when I saw you at Azure City. So, um, according to league rules, I have to give you this. Nymph badge. A nymph? Isn't that like someone who loves sex? Or maybe I'm just tripping. The Nymph Badge allows you to use Flash outside of battle. Oh no, Flash is in this game. Oh no. I also want you to take this along with you too. Consider it as a gift for such a great battle. Oh no, the dogs are acting up. My apologies, guys. TM breaks after one use, so use it wisely. Silver Wind. The attack blows powdery silver scales at the foe. I guess Yanma had that, but she just didn't use it. It, um, uh, it may also raise the user's um, abilities. Isn't it cool? Pretty cool. But what's not cool is non-reusable TMs. I miss those. Okay, now that Gordian Town Gym Leader has been defeated, 
and there's no gym leader in Azure City, we're going to have to uh, backtrack once more. Wait, where's the uh, Pokemon Mart? Let's actually buy some repels. Fluffy tail now. Let's not have that. Repels, please. Yes, I'll buy maybe three, four. We will lose the exact amount of money that we gained from the gym leader, which is okay. That's the whole point of earning money, to spend them. Because we need to get through roots quicker. Also, I think, I think Precious is just one level away from evolving. I'll put Marshall up front. Never used you. Literally swept that gym with Precious. Goodness. Um. Hmm. Okay. More Raltzes. Morphic Tunnel. Here's uh, where we put on the repels. Only 100 steps, so we have to be a little bit frugal. Yeah, see here? The rocks that used to be here, they are Gonski now. And this guy gave us Rock Smash. Which never really helped at all with the Gym Leader, but it's just an HM to have. I don't think we can actually use it outside of battle yet, because... What do you call this? Oh, that's perfect, too. What do you call this? Quinn's badge only allows you to use Flash outside of battle. Oh, come on! First patch of grass and already a wild Pokemon? I don't want to catch anything here. Get away from me. Okay, all this backtracking, man. I mean, I love the backtracking system in Pokemon Gaia, but this one's a bit too much. Just saying. Hey, you, wait. What? There's a lot to do in Azure City. What? Where am I supposed to go? I thought this guy would, like, move away now. I don't know where to go. Ah, okay. The museum's legendary exhibit is now open. Okay, okay. Many people say those three Pokemon live on two islands called Naval Rock and Birth Island. Where are those islands, and how do we get there? All these questions, I do not think anyone has the answer. Well, I do have the answer. Action replay. Anywho. Damn, Statue of Lugia. We're gonna register these in our Pokedex real quick. Ho Ho and Docs. Oh shit. That's the uh, speed form Deoxys too, damn. So our Pokedex now has a bunch of empty space. Well, actually, never mind. Looks like they weren't registered. A oh, national, I mean. We have a national Pokedex too, yeah. Plenty of open space over here. That's fine. We'll hopefully fill that up. Me? I've made those statues. To be honest, I've seen those legendary Pokemon before. That's why I know how they look like. Hey, you should come back after you become the champion because I have a nice thing for you. Is it gonna be a rare Pokemon? I'd be excited for that. Yo, there's nothing I can do here anymore. I thought there was going to be something that would trigger an event over there in the legendary booth. Will the guy let me through now? No. What else are we supposed to do? Maybe go back to this guy? Wait, no, where's that one guy who... Asked us to uh, show him our badge. I might have to read the FAQ after this. Oh shit, no, this is, this is not the one. Where's that house that kid was at? Maybe this one? Wait. <clears throat> yeah, Stranger School. This is the one. There we go. Hey, that's Quinn's gym badge. It's really cool. TMO3? What is that? Water Pulse! Yo, use it wisely. We can absolutely use that on Marshall. But our attack stat is... Ugh, our attack stat is better than our special attack. We'll keep Water Gun. Gosh. We'll wait for Waterfall, maybe? I don't want to waste Water Pulse right now. But dude, what on earth are we supposed to do? Was it wrong of me to backtrack all the way here? Yeah, I've literally visited everything your place has to offer, my dude. I don't have cut yet, don't do I? Yeah, I don't have cut. I can't access this area yet. 
Were we not supposed to go back to Azure City? Where are we supposed to go? Oh, what if... Let me repel real quick. What if, what if that tunnel to Amethyst City has been finished or something, maybe? I'm just trying to echo-locate where I'm supposed to go. Because uh, this game's not giving me any pointers whatsoever. Also, no black or white repel system? For shame, Pokemon Azure Horizons. I mean, I don't want to bash, but eh, it's just kind of inconvenient. But after all, though, this is a game from 2009, so black and white did not exist yet. Alright. Oh, come on. Repels wear off so quickly. Let's get away. I want to run into as few wild Pokemon as possible. Get away from me. Maybe this place? Oh, come on! This underground path leads all the way to Amethyst City. It's still being worked on. Guys, I might have to end the episode here, because I actually need to go check out the FAQs as to where on earth I'm supposed to go, because this game is not really that good whatsoever in giving pointers as to where to go next. No one pointed anything out. Maybe we can go talk to the gym leader again? More gym leaders out there that are more powerful than me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, see? Nothing. Nothing. Let's check the town map before we end. Literally, the only way to go is from Azure City. You go up to this area here. And no one's showing us how we can get past that guy in Azure City. I might have to check facts if there are any. So yeah, I'll see you in the next episode when I figure things out. So leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more. And tomorrow, hopefully we have direction. So yeah, take care everybody. Bye-bye.